and welcome to Designing with Adobe XD. I'm Marissa from exopixel.com and in this video I'll be showing you how to design a really cool Instagram image grid for the destination website that we've been designing in this series. So let's jump right in. First, draw a red borderless rectangle that's 1920 by 120 pixels. Then write follow Toronto on Instagram. The font we'll use is ACA Bat, white and size 28. Be sure to align the text to the center. I got this white Instagram icon from the Instagram brand assets website. So I'm just going to paste it and resize it so it fits nicely beside the title. Now it's time to design the image grid using Adobe XD's repeat grid tool. First, select the rectangle tool and draw a rectangle that's 384 by 270 pixels. Fill it with gray and give it a red border so that it's easier to see on the artboard. Select the rectangle and then head on over to the appearance panel and select repeat grid. Select the green handle and drag it to the end of the artboard. Then hover the mouse in between the repeat grid's margins, you'll see it turn pink and then click and drag until the margins for the grid is zero. In other words, remove the margin. Drag the green handle once more so that the grid is flush with the artboard. Now, drag the bottom green handle to reveal the second row of rectangles and then remove the margin. Also, be sure to remove the red border around the rectangles. So now that our grid is set up, I'm going to select four unique images from my folder and then drag and drop them onto the repeat grid. I got these really nice photos from Adobe Stock, one of my favorite places to get high quality stock photos. So there you have it. You've just created a really cool Instagram image grid using the repeat tool in Adobe XD. Stay tuned for the next video in this series. I'll see you there.